my name is Douglas Elwell, and I currently serve as a regimental piper to psychological operations. I've been playing the bagpipes for a little over 40 years. I, uh, I learned in California, and, and when I PCS'd here to North Carolina, continued on. Uh, it was much later that I found the bagpipes, and, uh, and I found I could, I could learn and make music on the I consider music on the bagpipes. The bagpipes were primarily used by the Scots, although there are other countries that play bagpipes. The, the Scottish bagpipes, or the Great Highland bagpipes, are the ones that are most recognized by most people. The military used the pipes because they found that the Scottish soldiers responded greatly to them. They also found that when the, the Scottish troops playing the bagpipes came, came against uh, their adversary, that the adversaries usually were quite uh, hesitant to, to move forward. They, they really were afraid of the bagpipes. They didn't understand the sound. So the British used the Scottish as their shock troops. The Scottish always went forward with the pipers in front of them. So the first thing that the enemy saw was the Piper. I think it's interesting that in World War I, with the Pipers leading the troops out of the trenches, the British troops out of the trenches, the Germans used to refer to the, the Scottish troops, and especially the Pipers, as the ladies from hell because of their fighting ability and, and that great din that they made as they came out of the trenches. The, the Army has a set of traditions but I believe PSYOP has some traditions too that they should, they should nurture. It helps to bring us all together. I believe PSYOP is a very important on the battlefield. I think that the soldiers need to realize that and we need to cultivate the, and maintain the traditions that we do have so that soldiers down the, down the way recognize the, the importance of, of our history. One of the traditions that I've seen last longest has been the bagpipes. And why the bagpipes in Siop? Well, father of Siop, uh, General McClure, McClure, good Scottish name, who was proud of his Scottish heritage. It's quite common in Scottish military that regiments are named for their leader. We in the U.S. Army don't name regiments for our, our leaders, but this is McClure's regiment, really. So it should have bagpipes. The bagpipe has more flexibility in entertaining the troops on the move. We play marches to lead troops into battle. We play retreats to bring them home from battle. And honestly say, I've never had a wardrobe malfunction with my kilt. However, I take pride in the fact that I have assisted with uh, wardrobe malfunctions of people at ceremonies I have participated in. There is no saying that it takes seven years to make a piper. I really hope that when I can no longer play, that there's somebody there to step in. Uh, as a matter of fact, if there was somebody there to overlap with me, that would be absolutely fabulous.